this video tutorial will uh, help you to remove uh, unwanted extension that is called COVID-19. Uh, there is nothing really um, related to this COVID-19 extension that could be uh, worth installing it. The developers of this extension claim that uh, with this uh, service you'll be able to get the uh, latest news about the coronavirus and the economic situation uh, in various countries immediately uh, after these news get published. However, when you actually agree with the proposal and uh, decide to add this extension to Chrome, it says that it can read and change your data on a number of websites. It also replaces the page you see when opening a new tab. It can read your browsing history and it will change your search settings to uh, coronavirusstate.herokuapp.com. It also can read and change your bookmarks. So uh, I strongly advise you not to agree with such a proposal. Otherwise, all these um, unauthorized uh, interferences will take place and the extension COVID-19 will co control a lot of browser settings. But if you clicked on this Add Extension button, uh, there is still a way to fix uh, your browser and to get rid of it. And so in the rest of the guide I'll explain how to get rid of that extension. So you can see that right now the browser, the Google Chrome browser is indeed hijacked. So when we open the new tab, we have some uh, unfamiliar page in the Russian language. No, many, no matter how many tabs we open, this COVID-19 extension is in control. And if we submit some search query, we notice that the results are delivered by Yandex.ru, a Russian search engine. So if you are familiar, if you are accustomed to uh, Google search, you will no longer enjoy Google search as your main provider, but you will have to combat this Yandex rule. And by the way, even uh, surfing the web through Yandex.ru will uh, be getting on your nerves because the results may be delivered uh, with a, a long time gap, a uh, long time will pass after you submit the query and get any results, by the way. Uh, well, at least in my case it happens like that. So I recommend you to get rid of this extension as soon as possible because it also tracks all your submitted search queries and um, this uh, sensitive and private information might be granted to third parties without your permission. To remove this COVID-19 extension, do the following. Go to the browser menu, click on More Tools and select Extension. Find this COVID-19 extension, deactivate it and remove it. As you see, the browser is now fixed. But I additionally recommend that you perform scanning of your Mac with Combo Cleaner Antivirus for Mac. You may get it on the website combocleaner.com. Once you download, install the application and start it through the launchpad. Initially it will be the trial version. But the trial version works as a free scanner. It helps you get the clear picture of the security situation with your Mac. Click on Start Combo Scan button and let Combo Cleaner trial to perform the free scanning of your Mac. This is the end of scanning by Combo Cleaner Antivirus. The trial version gives you a chance to perform free scanning of your Mac computer and at the end of scan you'll see a detailed report about all uh, threats that may be the part of your Mac. Check the antivirus function and click on Review Results. This report will state the specific threat and its location, so you may find the location of each threat through your finder and you may uh, remove it manually or you may do it automatically but with the premium version of Combo Cleaner Antivirus program.